doing it. Yeah, I saw it. I saw it. Perfect, perfect. No, practice don't make perfect. Practice make permanence. Yo, what's up guys? It's your boy Kool-Aid Man 100X. How y'all niggas doing? Welcome back to another motherfucking video. I'm about to show you guys another Madden tip that I help you guys, man. This feature is not used in Madden a lot. I have not seen this feature and I came across it in the practice room. It was pretty cool. So, check this out. Um, you want to avoid fumbles, right? The QB fumbles and shit, man. This is for people that seize the blitzes. A lot of people don't use it often. A lot of people just take the sack or just say, fuck it, to lose the ball and try to get back from defense. But as you can see here, when you throw the ball, it causes a fumble and the shit get irritating as fuck. And you'd be like, oh, fuck, they're about to score and shit like that. But that's this is for the people that sit, uh, that can read the defense and see the blitzes that's coming and also see the blitzes that are coming. So check this out. Um... This is pretty cool. Now, let's say if you see the blitz coming, right, and you don't have time. So you press uh, R2, L2, and square at the same time to avoid the fumble. As you can see there, he started to go down. Now, I want to do it before. So to avoid the hit, you just want to press down. And it he ducks under a little bit. But this is the full adjustment when you press L2 and R2 and square. He just falls, right? He just do a slide or he just falls. Usually, you can press them both. He ducks under. You see, he falls under. But usually, he uh, try to avoid the hit, which is very good in a way. Because, see, he falls right under. So, he can hold L2, R2, and square. So, if you see the blitz coming, you feel as though they're coming and pressure you. So, right now, avoid it. <laughs> as you can see there. So, I saw the pressure. I'm like, okay, I'm back five yards. Okay. I see the blitz coming. The, the blitz coming heavy, so I try to avoid it. So, I won't use a fumble. This is a great feature to use. So you see how he dives over. He just completely loses sight of the quarterback when he dives like that. He covers the ball, so which is really good. Because you can do that, and he runs to the left. See, he slides. You can avoid the hit that way if he uh, flick the left stick right. If flick the left stick left, or left or right, he slides automatically. So that just prevents you from losing yards, too. You can go a little bit forward and, you know, slide in case you see the blitz coming a little bit too fucking fast. Which, in that case, you some people do blitz that fucking fast. <laughs> and you try to avoid it without fumbling. So you see that blitz, bam, you can slide to the left. And also, if you let him drop back and you see the blitz coming too soon, you can do it, too, as well in the backfield, too. So you want to avoid the yards. But it's a, definitely a quick tip to avoid the slide, as you can see here. You can avoid the slide, so it's a very good tip to learn. And people that sliding across the field and shit. So, yeah, I hope that tip help you guys out to avoid the fumbling that occurs at the quarterback position. But I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Also, man, hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, all that shit. Be the link in the description below. Make sure you add me on Snapchat because I love talking to you guys, man. Playing with my cat and dog and shit. Like little vlogs, I'll be talking shit and watching Netflix or anime. Just add me on Snapchat. It's fun. Trust me. You'll fucking love it. <laughs> um, also, man, uh, make sure you get to make sure you hit the eye in the upper right hand corner and get yourself a t-shirt. And also watch videos that's available on my channel as well. And also, guys, like, comment, and subscribe. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm on this bitch. Deuces.